<laughs> What's up, YouTube? What's up, YouTube? What's up, YouTube? What's up, YouTube? We're back again today with a new video, a new banger finally dropped. I know it's been a while, right? It's been since what? January? I, my last video is my ghost lime interview. I know I've been slacking off, but we're back again. And today, what we will be trying is going to be breaking the ground here. It's pretty amazing. All right, guys. So this drink that we're going to be trying today is actually imported from a different country. And I'm not just saying that it was made in a different country. This was actually a drink from a different country. That's in a different part of the world. In a different location in a different country. So, we're going to be trying it today. And, I'm going to tell you what it is right now. So, what the drink we're going to be trying is, is Al Reef Pineapple. And guys, I don't really know how to drink this, right? So, I'm going to bring out a cup with just Al Reef in it. And I'm going to be bringing out a cup with Al Reef and ice cream in it. Because it says that, there's an English side over here. It says it says it's a float. So, I don't know, usually when you, like when there's a float, when, there, when it's a float, you have to put ice cream in it. So, I have a little bit of vanilla ice cream. I'm going to put it in a cup and I'm going to pour the Al Reef in it and I'm going to make it a real float. Because I don't really know if it's a float by itself. But we have to try the actual drink by itself and have not the, the, the taste altered of it. Because if the taste is altered, then we can't get an accurate review. Accurate review. Actually. So, you know, I'm really excited to try this one. You know, as I've, I've never tried anything like this before. Um, the only pineapple drink I've ever had was Pineapple Fanta, actually. And I actually like that. I enjoy Pineapple Fanta. Get it at like a dollar store and it's pretty good. Pretty refreshing. Pretty aromatic. And it makes your taste buds do a dance. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? On your tongue? Not actually. Not actually. But it, it tastes really good. So, let's get right into the review. Alright guys, so I got my cup here. I got the cup. And we're going to be pouring the Al Reef into this cup. Without the ice cream first. Without the ice cream first. So, get the cup. We want to see the true color of it as well. That, I forgot to mention that. We want to see the true color of the Al Reef. And, whoop, that doesn't echo. But, let's get the Al Reef over here. Um, We got 110 calories. So... In case you were wondering about that, you can uh, you can probably there's the there's the barcode if you want to scan it. So now it's pouring. Out. So we got our cup and we got our Al Reef. Let's actually crack this. Actually, I don't know how this is gonna be, guys. Um, this says it expires February thirteenth, twenty twenty four. I've had it since March. It's been sitting in the back of my fridge. I keep forgetting to do something with it, but. I don't know what just happened, honestly. Okay, do I peel this off like that? What the heck? You peel off the whole tab and it just leaves an empty hole. That smells like straight pineapple juice. I don't know. Oh, was I supposed to shake this probably? Yeah, I was. Whatever. It's gonna settle anyway, by the time I get to my float. Anyways, let's pour it into the cup. A nice, it's a, eh, it's a little bit murky, almost. Um, yellow, like a pineapple. Pineapples are actually, they tend to be yellow when they're ripe. Um, but if you can see, I don't know if you guys can see that. I don't know if you guys can see, if you can see in the cup, but you can see a bit of pulp from the pineapple because it is pineapple juice so i don't know if this is just straight pineapple juice because it's kind of what it looks like but they made it sound like it was a pineapple like i don't know it's like i don't know i'm in, i'm intrigued though by how it looks i don't think it is carbonated however it looks pretty flat now 
something sometimes i get scared by pulp guys i'm gonna be honest so like when i open up a thing of like orange juice um pineapple juice i like i feel like it's what if that's an animal that crawled in there and it dissolved and it's like the the, the decaying body parts of it you know you ever think that sometimes like you think that like a mouse crawled up in the can before it got sealed shut and then uh it just like dissolved up in that can anyways let's try this so yeah again it smells a lot like normal pineapple juice like the dole stuffy in the little cans like the six pack um maybe this is just saudi arabia's version of it but you know let's give it a little sip I don't know. I don't know it literally tastes just like pineapple juice. It's nothing. I'm gonna be honest. It's nothing too crazy. I mean, it tastes good. It's a little bit su sweeter than normal pineapple juice. Yeah. Um, it's it's pretty sweet actually. How much sugar does this have in it? Hold on. It's got. 22 grams of added sugars so you know over in saudi arabia they must love sugar as much as we do here in the united states although although you might want to tap into g fuel zero sugar by the way anyways though not not a sponsor um but you know stuff with a lot of sugar in it tends to not be good for you when you consume a lot of that into your body and you know if you were to drink a lot of Al Reef, you probably wouldn't be the healthiest person. Um, but I actually don't know how many grams of added sugar in a normal uh, can of pineapple juice. But I'm guessing probably not 22 grams of added sugars. Let's finish this off here. Let's give it a little swirly swirl. I mean, it tastes good. I like it. I like normal pineapple juice as well, but it just seems like it's missing something almost. And it seems like it's missing something and it has too much of something that something that it has too much of is called sugar. It has too much sugar and it's too sweet and it does not make your taste buds do a dance, which is what the goal is here. Like a pineapple Fanta, it makes your taste buds do a little dance. Do my little dance, dance. Anyways though, now it's time to try it as a fuck. All right guys, so I just made it back to my room where my chair is, where I'm recording this video at. And I just have arrived with the cup of ice cream. Now, see, we have vanilla ice cream in there with a McDonald's straw and a spoon in the back. Classic float style. Usually, they have a, a straw and a spoon. Depends on where you go. Sometimes, they just have a straw, you know, whatever. But here, we have both for the full experience. So, anyways, let's get into pouring the Al Reef into the, the ice cream. Whoa, that looks nasty. <laughs> You'll see. It tastes so much like vanilla. It tastes. There's so much pulp in it. Do you guys see the freaking big thing of pulp come out? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, that's so gross. Oh. Ah! Dude. Daddy DK just invited me to a party, by the way, guys. Because I have my TV on right now. I'm sorry I couldn't join your party, Dakota. But I was trying out Reef. Anyways, though. This was freaking nasty because of how much pulp came out of it. I feel like if, it, if that much pulp didn't come out, I mean, the vanilla actually is pretty nice. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, let's get a little, let's get a little spoonful of it. Tastes a little bit like pineapple, like, I don't know. It's like pineapple cream a little bit, but it just grosses me. I can't drink it through the straw at all. It, uh, it get clogged up while the pulp gets pulp, clogged up in it. And it's so gross and it, uh, it's so gross, oh my gosh. I don't know, whatever, it's whatever. It's not, it doesn't go the best with ice cream, I'm gonna be honest. 
and some of the pulp looks like it's a little bit rotten because of how long I've had it sitting in my fridge. Um, I don't know, man. I, I mean, really, the final like verdict on this whole drink, Al Reef, this mysterious drink, which I don't, I don't know, did I get it from uh, Jungle Gyms, somewhere like that. But really, I don't think as a drink itself it is too bad. I think it's a solid pineapple juice just a little it's pretty sweet that's the only thing i'll say about it it's pretty sweet but it's a solid pineapple juice in itself right you know nothing bad i can say about it other than that once you get to the bottom of the can it will have pulp and i can blame it on myself because i remember in the beginning of the video i said i needed to shake it up and it does say on the side of the can it says shake well right here right it says shake well but i just didn't listen to instructions I didn't listen to instructions, so I'm sorry to my viewers, guys. Make sure you listen to instructions, guys. No matter if a can tells you it, if your teacher tells you, if your parents tells you, you got to follow those instructions to be successful in life. Life is Roblox. But this is our reef. Warning, the following clip is graphic. Viewer discretion is advised. Five minutes later. Give me some good steak. Tell me why you won't give me a cheesecake. Tell me why you never give me what I want. And I want a croissant.